I think Stu has a, another big bonnet head shark on here. The last one that Gary got was about four feet. That one looks to be a good size as well. Sure stripped off a lot of line there a few minutes ago. It's going to go down again. Coming near the anchor line here, Stu. Yeah. Oh, he's gone across. Go good. across it? No. He's all right. I'm in a good position here from the anchor line, hopefully. Got a lot of pull to it. Another big one. Just on a light hook. There he is. Oh, he did a flash. Beautiful. That was cool. A surface run, didn't That it? was cool. I was going to shut the video down until you got him up by the poke, but I, I think I got that on camera here. That's good. Yeah, this one's a bit smaller than yours, but he's still a good size. Good size, yeah. He's under the boat. They're good fun and good fighters. Hey, don't go under there, buddy. Spunky. It's like in the shrimp. Who are you bringing in? Right now, bonnet head shark. A what? Bonnet head shark. Oh, is that right? Yeah. We've got a couple of them, but before that, we were getting some, some whiting. No. Oh my god, then you can smoke it up and everything. It'll be good. Here he is up at the surface. Oh yeah. He's about three feet. We have to tire him out? Yeah. Yeah, we got him up to the boat and then you uh, put a gaff and then you can take the hook out. Uh-huh. They're fun. <laughs> think they're going to give up, they don't. Got a little, little life in them yet. Oh yes. So this is uh, Bonnet Head Shark. The uh, bigger one that Stu had on uh, broke off by the boat. And this is a smaller one that he caught uh, a little while later. There's a ton of them in the area right now, all sizes. So this is uh, Stump Pass, Florida, USA. Near uh, this is near nearest Inglewood, I guess, isn't it? Yep. Okay, we're gonna let this guy go, and we'll talk. To, we'll see you later.